Hey guys, Dean from Hellacious. I uh, wanted to uh, just run through as a follow-up to Amy's video, what's left uh, out of the last batch. They went pretty quick. Most of them went pretty quick. Uh, we do have a few left. I'll also show some of the others we have in the shop uh, and we'll go from there. We do appreciate Greg, Amy, and, and Lindsay's, both Lindsay's. Uh, they have been great business partners. Uh, we enjoy the brand uh, and a Amy and Greg and the folks over at Medford are great people. So we'll start over with the Swift Auto, uh, like a matte blue uh, with flamed pivot. This is Tonto, obviously. Um, you can see the, just the, the gorgeous colors uh, on that flame job. Same thing on the other side, the pivot, uh, as well as the clip. Just really, really snappy. Uh, gorgeous knife. Uh, Greg's actions are awesome. I love that quote-unquote Medford sound. So he figured out some way to get it into the autos. Um, we'll move on to the next one. Uh, OD Green with bronze. Uh, you can see the bronze hardware here. Uh, I really like this color combination. Uh, it just makes the knife very classy. Uh, and that bronze gives it some character. So... Um, just really, really cool knife. Move on to the Slim Midi. This is in the acid configuration. Uh, this pattern is bonkers. Uh, this beats the last acid that I had for sure from a pattern perspective. Just absolutely cool. Um, Jen did a short of this knife, uh, and it's in the hundreds of views right now. Uh, people are digging it. So this is Magna Cut. Um, Tonto configuration bronze with the acid clip. Uh, you can kind of see the acid here on the, on the clip itself. Um, I would encourage you to watch Greg's Magna Cut video. Uh, I really like the fact that he's trying to perfect their recipe. Um, so, uh, you'll see what he says about his use of Magna Cut moving forward. Genesis T, same thing. Uh, crazy acid on this one too. You can see it here deep in the grooves. I'm going to try to get that on the camera if I can. Um, just very cool acid in, in, in the finger grooves uh, as well as a knife. Same thing on the clip on the back of this. Um, I just think that the color combinations coming off the back of these knives uh, is berserk. I love it. It's like a purplish blue seems to match very nicely with the with the clip. All right, we have another Genesis T uh PVD out uh with flamed hardware PVD breaker, but as you can see here, uh the stop, the pivot and the clip are just very very well done. Um really highlights the black. Uh I think if you want a classy PVD knife uh, with some bling, but not, you know, crazy. This is it. All right. We have a consignment. Uh, this knife was never carried. Uh, the owner purchased it. Uh, so this is the Waki S. Uh, this life is no longer be uh, no longer made. So you have the dragon and the tiger, uh, with the wrapping. Very cool knife. What's cool about this is that the owner also um, had a custom stingray sheath made for it. Uh, the tiger that's there is uh, sterling silver. Um, pretty jamming sheath for the knife. Um, it does come with its uh, original little teeny tiny sheath. Um, uh, but I don't think that sheath does this knife justice. This one does. Amazing knife. Give us a call for a price on this one. All right, we have show lights. Um, very cool pattern. The bronze with the blue anno. Uh, this also has bronze hardware. Uh, titanium clip plane, which is kind of cool because it matches the blade. It really helps offset the spring uh, side of the knife. Really, really gorgeous knife. Infraction, next, PVD, Anno Blue, both sides, flamed clip. Uh, just very, very cool knife. Uh, that blue is amazing. Uh, I do like the PVD on the infraction. 
Uh, I think it offsets it and actually makes it look very, very cool. The PVD hardware on the front uh, just, you know, just helps, you know, I would say uh, uh, really offset the blue and makes it pop. M48, back to the OD green. Um, here you could see uh, bronze hardware, uh, the tank dreads, love it. On the back, bronze hardware as well, bronze clip, just very cool. Uh, we sell a lot of these knives where we can get them. Um, they're few and far between. So if you like this M48, uh, all these are on the website grab them all right we still have the cherry blossom i don't know why guys uh please leave comments below as to why this knife hasn't moved yet um just a gorgeous knife uh, the cherry blossoms pattern uh, is just so well done um it's just an awesome knife uh absolutely a fine knife for a man or woman um praetorian slim by the way um, just a great, great knife. All right. A smooth criminal. Um, red, really cool red with that PVD or with the flamed hardware. Uh, you can see there, it looks very cool. Uh, flamed hardware back here as well. Um, flamed on the back. And as well as the clip, I'm going to try to get that clip for you to show. There it is. Yeah, it looks cool. Uh, if you like button locks, uh, which I do, um, talk about a fidget spinner man, but also one that gets the job done. This is it. it does have the lanyard hole. Uh, if, if for you guys that do or don't know us uh, and you're new to the channel, um, Jen does custom lanyards. Uh, with a large array of beads that we have and patterns for the lanyard should you choose to put one on it. All right, Micro Praetorian. Um, again, PVD, uh, Blue Anno, uh, flamed hardware, uh, Blue Anno on the back, just pops. Um, you know, these little guys are uh, awesome, awesome workhorse knives. If you like the Praetorian, but you don't necessarily like the bigger guys, uh, the little guy is an excellent representation and will get the job done regardless of what you're doing. Great knife. All right, then we got the big boy. Uh, again, blue anno here. Uh, titanium hardware on uh, everything on this one. Just a really cool, I would call it not plain Jane, but uh, a really good entry into uh, the Praetorian series for the large guys. This is 3V. Uh, which is kind of cool, uh, and the Tonto configuration, which is the most desirable from, from our customer base. All right, I'm going to show you a, a, a star of the show. Um, as you guys know, we are a, a gun shop, uh, a full class three dealer as well. Uh, this is the standard manufacturing uh, 1911A1, uh, fully engraved uh, and case hardened. So beautiful gun uh the the engraving is sick uh it is engraved uh pretty heavily uh, on all most all of the pieces on the gun skeletonized hammer um just absolutely gorgeous gun uh if you're into 1911s and you want one that you can shoot but also uh represents you know a very awesome 1911 with all the engraving uh certainly give us a call for this beauty all right so you know last but not least guys you know we know we carry kpl now um we we are, are, are very successful with it uh, customer feedback is phenomenal um you know i would say give it a shot uh, if you decide that you want to purchase one of these knives, uh, feel free to add this as an add-on. I think, you know, it does absolutely work. Uh, like I said in a couple videos ago, I met them at Blade Show. Great, great couple. Um, and the product seems to be really, really working really well. So, 
check that out as well. Uh, as well as some other Medfords that didn't make the table. Uh, so if you're interested in any of these, give us a call, 800-936-3280. Uh, hit us up at, at hellacious.com. That's H-E-L-A-C-I-O-U-S.com. Uh, or on any social media, and we will be happy to uh, send one of these booties to your house uh, and make it yours. Thanks again, everybody. If you could like, subscribe, hit the, hit the bell, and please leave a comment. Um, we're finding that the, you know, the more comments we get, uh, the better the algorithm loves us. So uh, please leave a comment uh, below and let us know what you think of these, which is your favorite, uh, or what uh, patterns you'd like to see. Uh, or what other knives, you know, from Medford, or for that matter, any other maker that you'd like to see us uh, carry uh, U.S. base makers. Thanks again, everybody. We'll talk to you soon.